And are there any threads, you know, just to your overall philosophy about, you know, particular early stage sales leadership, both from your role now and, you know, previous roles leading sales organizations? Yeah, I mean, a couple of things. One, it's interesting that you talked about sort of, um, you know, experience with sales motions. And I think it's become, you know, it's become stating the obvious that, you know, even an early stage company, once you've established product market fit and started to hire sellers that you need a playbook, you need process, you need to walk through that and, and align it to, you know, the, the buyer journey and experience to, you know, optimize for growth. Mm -hmm. Many of these same organizations and larger ones are not treating hiring the same way. Um, they continue to make decisions based on gut, based on winging it, based yeah. on the sort of expediencies afforded by one's network. And I think at a fundamental level, you know, my point of view, which has been sort of developed over many years, is that that's not the, the best way to team build. It's not the way to build your organizations that are cohesive, aligned to your values and purpose in the market. Um, you, you need a hiring process, much like you need a sales process, right? You need to start right. by defining the attributes you see, ideal candidate profiles, and then a process to go outbound and, and find those people to um, respond to in, inbound interest, right? It, it's very similar to, you know, how your, your sales um, you know, playbook is probably architected, yet surprisingly, many organizations just don't have this. And I think at a fundamental level, my business is geared around helping organizations do this better, whether yeah. we're consulting with you on building that process or, or coming in as recruiters, we want to do it on the backs of a great process and, and really help you find great people. You're listening to Accords from Vendorship to Partnership. For more sales and startup insights like this, please be sure to subscribe here or at inaccord.com slash podcast. Thanks for listening.